and so it's around 7 a.m. in the morning and I'm going to show you around Beijing Language and Cultural University so let's go <laughs> So I was lucky that I got like a bike nearby and I don't usually find any bike nearby my dorm but this is right in front of my dorm there's like a basketball court we'll get to that later so we're heading towards the main main bay now Uh, our class 
must have way too many people because people keep transferring to our class. And you can actually transfer class, any classes here, just for the first three days. Today, I think. Let's try. Oh my god, guys, it's not closed and cute coffee vending machine. It's often like out of stock. I'm not sure why, but my my class is on third floor. They're they're like four, five, five floors. I think five. Yeah, five floors. And it's pretty much the same in all the floors. So.
the left side of the teaching building, you have like this. And this is where you usually um, register for your accommodation. And let's see, the working time. get it wrong guys that's only for the accommodation it's not for the registration so I'm going to show you the canteen next because there isn't much to see here <laughs> yeah so the canteen next they have like um, four floors four floors but uh, the third floor is like closed currently, but they say that the third floor is the best out of one, two, three. And the fourth is like more like um, high ups restaurants. Not really high ups, but it looks like fancy restaurants. So like they have like Korean there, and Japanese, and Thai, and a Western cafe. So we'll go there now. The canteen is right across the registration building, so it's really convenient. You see the south gate. So I've never been to the fifth floor before. I'm not sure what's there. So yeah. Oh, they're still closed. Let me know. This is actually the cafe. It's like the fancy cafe. It looks like book tower or something.
this is the Korean restaurant and it's all closed I think I'm too early and yeah we're gonna head down oh my god I should have like closed my bike now it's gonna be a long walk That was where I got out just now and straight up ahead is the tennis court, the basketball court and uh, they also have like badminton court here. Um, should we just um, go towards the courts first before before we go to the dorm? I think, I think yeah. this uh gym sets like over there and ping pong or table tennis same thing but yeah it's like on the other side though when we have soccer field Let me go up. Oh, anyways, this is my room. It's actually quite neat. Like, um, the toilet. Hi. So, um, it's not 
that bad. Like, except for the bed. Because the bed is hard as hell. It's like you can't. It's really, really hard as hell. And I had trouble sleeping here because my body aches all the time. But yeah, they also gave me TV which was placed like that. But I moved it down so that I can put my stuff there. And we have like this wardrobe. Walk-in wardrobe, guys. So I only put my bags here because I'm only staying here for like a month. And so I left all my clothes inside my luggage, which is there. Yeah. Hey guys, so that's all for today's video. And if you guys have any questions related to uh, BLCU, also known as Beijing Language and Cultural Cult Cultural Cultural University, or you have any questions about Beijing, don't hesitate to ask me like on the comment below. So thank you for watching. <laughs>